horrible. The Soviets swept the pair's medals at the last World Juniors, as they do so often. There seems to be no end to great partnerships coming out of the Soviet Union. And the defending champions are back. On the strength of their short program, Elena Leonova and Janata Krasnitsky, who we watch now, appear unbeatable. The rules have been changed, and the men can skate in juniors to the age of 18. So he is 18. She's only 13. Ted, I think the opening of the program has to be mentioned. That was a magnificent triple twist that, that they did. So unusual um, on this level. Now that is quite amazing because what they did there was a very difficult individual combination which demonstrates their ability to skate individually as well as together. One of the great problems that pair skaters face uh, when they're starting out is to have a very, very oversized male skater and a tiny female skater. It doesn't always work except when the little girl is as good as she is, and this one is a very strong skater, can keep right up with her partner. That was a very unusual twist throw, but she did touch down with her free throw, so it wasn't without flaw. there. That was amazing. Throw double axle followed by individual double axles. Very difficult. You are not going to see this on the very highest level in the world. One thing that is refreshing about this pair is a certain nonchalance. They are not Frenetic. They are not dashing around the ice with terror in their eyes. They're, they're enjoying it. They're feeling the music. And perhaps this is a result of the fact that they're the defending champions and they have that bit of experience behind them. of their skating which really separates them from the rest of the group is the speed and maturity at the very end of the program. This is what really makes the difference between a champion and a fifth or sixth placer. This was a strong program, not without a mistake, but probably very difficult to beat. They are the defending champions. They did win the short program. Elena Leonova and Gennady Krasnitsky of the Soviet Union. A very athletic display. Waving to some friends in the audience here in Kitchener. I thought 
something that was rather characteristic of the program was a, a kind of lyricism which you don't often see in a young pair that usually comes with years and years of maturity one of their excellent lists was in a very interesting uh, three leg position and very strong this is certainly going to hold up even in a world championship well excellent marks five sixes there from the first two judges very consistent marks with technical merit and as you say, they they're, they appear most nonchalant about the entire undertaking here. Of course, having won this World Juniors once before, they know what it's all about. Now the marks for artistic impression, and they are higher at 5'7", is the highest mark we've seen so far. That's from Heinz Ulrich Balper of East Germany, that 5'7". The one thing about this little girl was that she radiated energy and personality in spite of the very tiny uh, character she that she has. 